Okay, guys, so it is time for the plating. So please watch. Okay, I'm gonna sit you right there. And let's come over here to my beautiful plate. I have a plate and a bowl here. Um, just gonna dry, dry it off a little bit. Pulled out one of my nice plates. <laughs> really want to have to, I have to do it like this because there's a different combination I'm doing. So that's why I'm using this other plates that I have in my kitchen. I put one in the corner, very pretty like that. All right, and this has been cooling down for about 15 minutes. So we're ready to go. However, I wanted to show you how I do my lettuce. I use just a plain head lettuce and I make little cups is what I do to put it in the beautiful deliciousness. And then I also put, you'll see exactly how I do it, but I also use my skin uh, to my avocado. I clean it out really good. I use that as presentation for garnish for the soup as well. And I also add a little soup in here too. All right, so that's why I made a little twist here. And of course, if you've seen in my last videos, you'll know that this is that beautiful Parmesan corn, uh, peppercorn. Uh, dressing super good goes great with this dish so if you're gonna grab a dressing please try this dressing it's really good with this dish all right so I have some here and if you look I have some back here so I already have some uh, shredded lettuce here on my little thing here with the avocado and I'm gonna show you how I do everything all right so this is the cup I made for for this dish here all right, so we're gonna go ahead and sit it really pretty. And after I'm done with the plating, of course, I'm gonna give you guys a nice up close, okay? And this this stuff is to die for. And like I said, this is still a cool, warm, I said warm salad. It's still warm salad, so delicious. I just added those neck bones. You can X them out if you like, but trust me, they go, this tilapia always goes really, really good with um, neck bones, pork neck bones. You gotta try it. All right, so I'm gonna fix this really pretty. And the first thing I'm gonna do is add a little bit of the yuca. Here's my beautiful yuca, and I just have some pepper, some um, canola oil, a little bit of uh, salt, and that's it. I mixed it up really pretty. All right, so we're gonna put a couple of these pieces right into this beautiful presentation I'm gonna show you guys in a minute. Trying to get some more bigger pieces in there. All right, that looks good. All right. So what I do is I spread it around very pretty in the outer part, part of the head of lettuce. Okay, and I'm gonna show you what it looks like because I know you can't see because of this flat flap, but you'll get a perfect picture, I promise. Mm, so good. And so I'm gonna get to that avocado here that I cleaned out. Oh wait, wrong one. And I'm just gonna make sure I get this off real quick. All right. and like I said, I just clean these out the best that I can. I do like to use them as bowls sometimes, okay? And if you see, it's just the skin of the avocado and I just use them as bowls as well too. So we're gonna put that over here for garnish as well. All right. So we're going to add in our deliciousness. All right. Now this spoon is a drainer. So if you look up close here, let me bring this over here. All right. If you look up close, let me just show you very quickly. Look at that. Yum, yum, yum. Look how I have this set up. Okay. Deliciousness. <laughs> okay. All right. So this spoon here has holes. So, so everything's going to get drained out. It won't. So my salad will be nice and still nice and ready to eat so you just kind of make sure you dry it out very pretty make sure it's nice and dry you don't have to pat it or nothing because you don't want to lose the flavor and then i just sit it right in the middle of that so beautiful i add some more tilapia i try to go for like the tilapia to add some more of that on top as well okay very very pretty all right so Here's where it gets interesting. <laughs> All right, so what I do next is I take the juices, okay, and I'm gonna give you up close to that, the juices, to all that yumminess, that naturalness from the pork and the fish and all those great ingredients. I take that, 
and I put it right into my avocado skin, just like that. Okay, let some come out. Because you can use that sauce as a dip with anything. All right, let me just wash my hands real quickly. All right, and now we're gonna go for the beautiful bowl. Now the bowl gets everything, okay? Gets everything in there, the pork bones, all the juices, everything. All right, and there you have it. Look at that. Now let's not forget our avocados. So what I do is I just, I have them like this. I just split them like that, just like that. And I add them right around the beautiful head of the salad. Okay. And then I have shredded salad here. Now this is the head shred salad and I just add it right on top, just like that. Okay, and that's it. You got your yuca, delicious neck bone tilapia head salads with that avocado and all those great ingredients. You have your sauce on the side from the natural juices. And then you also have your little bowl like a soupy. So you get all, this is like a full course meal here, honey, that I did. So let's show you what I did and let's see the plating. Give me a minute to wash my hands. <laughs> I like a drum low, a drum roll. <laughs> Tongue twisted today, getting a little tired. All right, I'm gonna do the flip side. And there you have it. Look at that. Look at that. That is the salad. So beautiful. Cooked to perfection, placed neatly, and a beautiful, simple head of lettuce that only cost about a buck at 50. Something simple you can do in your kitchen. I got a pack of those neck bones for about three bucks. Um, and the fish, the lapia is never that expensive. So there you have it, beautiful salad. And then you see it right there, see a better look. And then you're gonna see the avocado skin that I use to pour some of those juices in there. And you can dip that in there. You can dip your avocado and your pork bones. And then I also did a little extra, like you can X the soup out. Uh, this for me here is enough with that sauce, but you can add, if you're really hungry, add in a little dish on the side. I just did it for presentation so beautifully. You have that soup, that pork bone, neck bone with that tilapia and all that deliciousness. Look at that. And that's some good stuff. So there you have it, guys. And I am going to enjoy with my daughter. She's waiting patiently. And um, we're going to hit the sack. And we have a long day tomorrow. So again, I just want to say thanks again, guys, for watching. We love you all. Thanks for continue to support me. I see that I got more um, subs on my channel. Thank you so much. You don't know what that means. Okay, so this girl's going to say ciao. And... I'm going to chef something up tomorrow, something simple again. My daughter wants me to do like um, like lunch meat sandwiches or something. We'll figure it out, but something at home when we get home from the long ride and the long day. And again, I just want to thank you all for continuing to support me and watch me on my YouTube channel. I actually got a nice big board that I'm going to be putting here that I bought at Walmart. So every time I chef something up, I, I'll have it written really pretty for you guys. It's like a one of those gla glass um, glass clipboard thingies where the, you can write on and then you can erase it off instead of me doing like all those decorations and stuff. It makes it a little easier for me, even though I still enjoy doing all those things. So I might be adding a little drawings on there too, but it's easier. I could just wipe it and then bam, I'll have what I'm cooking. So that's great. All right, guys. So I'm going to let you check this out before I say bye. All right. There you have it. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Mm-hmm. All right, and look at that. Look at all that deliciousness left and the yuca. All right, guys, this is good night for me. I love you guys so much. See you tomorrow.